Uh, everyone in Chrome is going to want to know what the weather's doing, Alex. Well, yeah, it's looking a bit windy, I'm afraid, Amelia. It was a bit of a cool and fresh start to the day this morning. Last night we had a lot of clear skies, so it was another chance to see the spectacular supermoon. Wasn't quite as full as the previous night, but still pretty big and bright out there. Now, tonight it is going to be cloudier and we are moving into a more unsettled period, so not such a good chance of seeing it overnight tonight. Uh, we are going to have some fairly blustery winds over the next couple of days with the chance of some rain, more significant rain on the way Friday night and into Saturday. Today. At the moment, we've got the remnants of ex tropical storm uh, Ernesto moving across us. Uh, it's not going to bring us any significant rain, but it is going to mean some strong winds over the next 24 hours. Those winds are expected to pick up overnight tonight. A fair bit of cloud out there, but some clear spells developing later in the night. Now, tonight it'll be a bit warmer than last night. It was quite chilly with many places in single figures last night, but tonight around 12 to 13 degrees, a warmer uh, air mass and generally more cloud around. Now the winds will pick up through the night and into tomorrow we could find some fairly strong wind gusts out there. We've got to watch out for this next system pushing in from the west bringing a splash of rain for tomorrow night. But tomorrow is all about a cold front ahead of it and along it some very strong winds. No significant rain but there could just be the odd sharp shower and then things will tend to ease down into the afternoon so it's possible wind gusts could approach 45 miles an hour for the middle part of the day temperatures getting to around 22 celsius once it's cleared through those winds will ease down later in the afternoon and then the chance of some rain overnight that'll clear out of the way as that cold front pulls away on friday but it will develop a bit of a wave on it so it's possible we could see some fairly significant rainfall on friday night into saturday that could be welcome for our gardens it's been a very dry month indeed some uncertainty as to how wet saturday is going to be but for the rest of the bank holiday it is looking a bit warmer and more settled Amelia. Alex, thank you very much. On the sofa today. If I knew you were coming, I would have tidied up a little bit, Alex. Well, it's all but, very cosy <laughs> here, Angie. Yes, it makes a change to be on the sofa with it you. It does. It's lovely to have you company. Let's fess up, shall we? Sometimes the uh, technology, shall we say, doesn't play ball, yeah, does it? The, and that's what it's done today. The weather <laughs> graphics are not there today. It's just not happening. But we can chat about the weather, we which um, can. is interesting over the next few days, <laughs> because we are moving into a much more unsettled weather pattern at the moment. And you'll have noticed that it's turned winter. Windier. It's going to be windier still into tomorrow and Friday. And we've got the remnants of ex-tropical storm Ernesto to contend with on Friday. So particularly Friday morning, wind gusts could be as high as 50 miles an hour. So not the best weather. We've sort of lost that beautiful sunshine and that calm forecast with those blustery conditions continuing. Now, if we look at the graphics that we've got, so that's the weather from the sofa. Thanks, Alex. It was lovely to have you company. Hello, some very windy conditions over the next couple of days. Those winds will pick up tonight from the southwest. Initially, a lot of clear sky out there, but we'll see increasing amounts of cloud from the west and possibly one or two showers as we start the day tomorrow. Warmer than last night, most places in double figures as we start the day. So tomorrow we've got this cold front crossing the country. There'll be some strong winds during the morning. They could gust close to 40 miles an hour at times. Some patchy rain moving through. Uh, the winds will ease down for a time uh, into the afternoon and perhaps we'll see some late evening sunshine, but still the threat of one or two sharp showers. So these are the wind gusts by the middle of the day. Temperatures up to around 22 Celsius. Another very windy day on the way for Friday. Looking largely dry, rain spreading and later could be a wet start to the weekend.